Hello everyone. So in this video, we will be talking about a skirmish battle. Now you see here it says unsaleable fortress, but it's not unsaleable fortress because maybe due to some game bug. But uh, this AI is called Pumpkin Hunt, and uh, this AI is different than any other kinds of AI. And this is my partner, and I'm going to play with him. So let's go. Now battle map is Desert Cross and it is not any normal co-op skirmish, it's different, I already told you. You see initially we got a lot more units than we get usually. I'm the YOLO player here, okay, so first showing you how we develop. So I added 3 supply center before upgrading my HQ so that I will be getting maximum amount of resources while even we are going to collect the resource containers. Now you see we have positioned our units at this point and I have barracks and vehicle factory also I'm going to produce armadillos and grenadiers non-stop and he's also collecting the resource containers we're not missing out any containers we need them for our developments and you see uh, the positioning I have positioned one unit here one unit here and uh, no need to position here because the units will be reinforced from this pathway and main army is always there now you see here uh, one pumpkin is here and we have to uh, fill the bar of this pumpkin okay and the enemy units will try to capture the pumpkin you see enemy units uh, came inside and enemy units can also capture pumpkins but enemy AI bot has to collect 20 pumpkins in order to win while you can win by just collecting 10 pumpkins now my partner uh, is having initially some trouble I'm just helping him with four grenadiers because the initially the situation wasn't too good for us okay now you see above two bars this is for uh, the bot and for ten pumpkins the accumulated number of uh, me and my partner when it reaches ten then we will win okay good pumpkin Thankfully, we also needed it. You see yellow colored unit and yellow color is my unit So he got I got more units and uh, I'm keeping them at this location because it's very necessary and meanwhile I'm also uh, f uh, Filled up my command points now adding five supply centers so I can continue reinforcing my units And you see he's also producing grenadiers armadillos non-stop he has three supply centers so far okay now here come on attack boost now you will see that we will be keep on facing the enemies very quickly uh, very rap at a very rapid rate and now another pumpkin arrived at his side and when the pumpkin arrives these are the two entrances of the enemy AI base from where the enemy units come out so we will just uh, have to prevent these units from collecting the pumpkins and we will be collecting the pumpkins instead and also like pumpkin madness tournaments these pumpkins can be either good or bad and which uh, also might change the situation of the game now he got some bad pumpkin and very unfortunately it's a very big loss that both of his jaguars are dead and jaguars play a very vital role in this game unfortunately his both jaguars had to die because of this bad pumpkin he won't have any more jaguars toward the bow okay now you see the location of the next pumpkin is at here that's why I had always placed some units around because I know that I can collect these pumpkins quickly and my main army will be confronting the units that will be coming to grab those pumpkins now you see these jaguars are always helping me out from distance because grenadiers are not going to survive much longer and I'm also going to keep my armadillos on the move all the time. Okay, I got some good pumpkin and it provided some units of my ally, one armadillo and two grenadiers. Okay, so after they fail to collect they will retreat but I'm not allowing them to retreat I am deciding to kill them off right here there will be no more uh, of these units coming again 
Okay. And also attacks going on from his side as well. That's why uh, using Armadillo, I think it's very important because there will be a large number of Cyclones and Fire Assaults. If we just focus on infantries, then there are, is a big chance that our units will eventually collapse. You see what is happening here right now. I'm in a big trouble. I don't have much units. However, reinforcing some units continuously. And he's going to collect this pumpkin uh, at his side. And uh, it's uh, too bad that his Jaguars got destroyed. He doesn't have any Jaguars to survive. And you see, I at least have my two Jaguars, which I'm using, uh, maneuvering properly to get some advantage. Now some YOLO units from this good pumpkin. Now already I have uh, upgraded the HQ into level 3 and having a uh, 2 vehicle factory for producing armadillos and also producing grenadiers at the same time. Okay, now another battle is going on and he's capturing this pumpkin with this grenadier and meanwhile he is also properly using his armadillo and grenadiers. Okay, too sad. He's already in trouble and more bad pumpkins are popping out. So I told him to send me some help and he is doing it by sending these armadillos because I told him that my defenses were collapsing. Uh, we were communicating while the, uh, while the battle was going on. Okay, I told him to move a unit here because if a pumpkin pop out at this location, uh, we will be in big trouble. Okay, but the next location for the pumpkin is here. I'm moving my unit here and meanwhile my units are going to handle the things at this place and also units are coming out from this entrance as well fire salt starting to come out the okay another bad pumpkin just destroyed my one uh, coyotes so better not to collect the pumpkins using jaguars because that's your most valuable unit if you lose your jaguar you might as well lose this ai if you're trying for any top result okay too sad he's uh his units has been crushed here and uh, he have only grenadiers and not many of armadillos that is really putting him into bad prop, uh, condition. We're collecting this one and obstructing these units. So these units keep on coming non-stop. I'm not sure what is the source of these units. The enemy units you can see green colored and blue colored. Probably the green colored are all reinforced uh, reinforcements. They came out of nowhere and where the blue units they're produced from factories. That's why you see so many uh, green units now since his units have collapsed and he's having a very hard time uh, with both of his Jaguars being dist has been destroyed so I need to now take off the take on the lead and I need to destroy much more number of these units otherwise we won't be able to do much good okay uh, what is happening I just reacted a bit too late very late uh, I was uh, moving my I was always moving my armadillos and uh, whenever this uh, Zeus come closer I always focus on this Zeus so that uh, my two Jaguars survive because these two Jaguars are firing these enemy infantries rampaging the whole time Okay, you, so you see how much important these two Jaguars are. All my units dies only for saving these two Jaguars because as long as these two Jaguars are intact, they will keep on destroying the enemy land armies as long as they come.
Okay, another on my side. I'm, I'm happy that it is on my side. My partner is in a very big trouble because uh, because he doesn't have any Jaguars to support him like I do. Okay, there is no stop of these units coming. And because the enemy, we did not allow the enemy pumpkin to collect any single pumpkin, so enemy are getting more and more angry and they're attacking with more forces. Now the last one is here. Okay, you now I have sent some units to cover this area and get this pumpkin. And meanwhile, this uh, fighting here is non-stop, always going on. Now I was able to only hold out because of the fi extra firing radius that resistance units have and because of these Jaguars, otherwise I could not have survived it. Okay, another bad pumpkin, what it does, destroying my these units, no matter, because we already collected 10 pumpkins, so the victory is ours uh, before 13 minutes, although I don't think it will be a top result, but we can try as many times as we want before the stage ends.